Good afternoon. It's late on Sunday afternoon and I have decided to do a video because I missed uh, my video yesterday. I was working on something and just didn't um, get the video done. So we have this here. I still have to finish decorating this. Um, we have our little bits and pieces in here, which I love. I need to actually make put something in that pocket in there. And these, I think, are done. If I remember correctly, yes. Oh, I like those. That was the front, and then that's the back. So they go in that pocket there. Of course, you could make more things. Then we've got this little, um, got to make something to go in there, this little envelope that I made in another video. And I'm going to make some tags. So, um, I mean, it won't be anything too inventive, I don't think. Um, so what I'm going to do is grab a piece of paper We'll grab this one 1944 it's a little bit shiny and grungy and we're going to do some um, We're gonna make it like a sort of master board and Collage actually I should trim that now where, are my, where are my skizzers? Here they are Ugh. So I had to move Christmas aside because I wasn't working on Christmas. Haha, <laughs> that's a surprise, isn't it? Um, so it got shoved aside for a minute yesterday and the day before. So how is everybody? I hope you're all well. And I'm um, having a great weekend. And the weather's good. The weather's good here. It's 17 degrees today, which is totally bizarre. But anyway, we've got 17 degrees. So I'm just going to glue this paper down in the spirit of using up scrappy-doos. Okay, so that's, isn't that pretty? I like that. And um, what else will we have? We've got lots of um, bits and pieces flying. No, that's not a scrap. Got lots of papers flying around here. I might grab even grab this one. This is not Christmas, but it's, it's the right colour. It's getting dark. It feels like it's really late, but it's not. I'm well, it, you know, it's near. It's four. It's getting dark, not used to it. So what can we update you on? Right, so um, I think, I don't remember if I said this in the other video, we're in, I, I think I told you we've been divided into three zones. We weren't quite sure. Um, yeah, I like that there, but I need to put some other things first, I think. Um, we're not quite sure, um, you know, if, we weren't quite sure. I, last time I think I spoke to her, we weren't, we weren't quite sure whether um, Lulu would be, um, what was going to happen with school. So because her school has workshops um, in the decree, they, they can go to school and do workshops. So she's going to go to school actually three times next week, which was a bit of a surprise. We thought, you know, maybe one or, once or twice, but actually three times for all of her um, subjects like architecture, um, art, like painting, they call it pittura and sculpture and and also gymnastics because they the school is near the beach and so they are going to um they take them down to the beach and make them do exercises on the sand lily said it's very hard work mum she doesn't like it and i said well it's good for you it is good for her so we're using big pieces here um i think that's the best way i've got these are from some of my kits that i did i think um, I've got them left over from the kits that I did um, in the 100 day project and so because they're green I think I might use them for Christmas. Why not? So um, so yep three days of school, three days at home and three days of school. Actually I should have torn that bit, should have, would have, could have, I'll tear, I'll tear it now. Tear it now. Now can you see my silly light jiggles about doesn't stay in the right spot. Chuck 
that over there. Chuck it. Let's just chuck it. I'm going to put that in there. And then we need to get some, um, I think we need some book page. So I get a lot of questions like when you make this type of sort of master board. Um, so when you make this type of master board, can, why don't I scan it? Well, I could scan this one if I'm using um, old books, you know, public domain stuff. Yes, I can then go and scan it. Um, if you go, then go, but if you go and add in something like a Florentine paper, which is new, so protected by copyright, or if you go and add somebody else's digital kit, that's a no-go for scanning. Um, or if you go and use Tim Holtz paper, that's also a no-go for scanning because they're protected by copyright. So you just have to be mindful. Um, now, I had some writing somewhere, just a minute. It's here in my mess of other stuff. Here it is. I'm going to put some of this in here. So you just have to be mindful of that. If you're planning on making masterboard and fabrics, like, don't be, I don't know about the um, those... Uh, US feed sacks or anything like that. I really don't know about the status of those as far as um, scanning is concerned. I don't know whether that, but you know, like new fabrics or fabrics of a certain type are quite often protected by copyright. So you could, I don't um, generally scan my fabrics because I'm not sure. When in doubt, don't do. I'm really not sure. And I'm not sure about those wallpapers either. I don't know about wallpapers. I don't really have many wallpapers, so it's not an issue for me. Um, we don't like. I don't have any of those. Well, I have a few bits of um, super old hand painted wallpaper. But actually, there I should pull them out. I never use them. It's like Hordsville. Um, but yeah, so they probably would be okay. But I don't know about the other types of wallpapers. That um, I don't know about those. I don't know what they're how it works with them so maybe people who have wall, wallpaper packs unless they're like you know wallpaper packs from um from the met and that where they put the you know the antique wallpaper samples in the public domain i don't know about the others they may not be um may not unless they're some from some famous company or something like that i just don't know about them so i don't generally um well, I don't have any to scan. I could scan those other ones that I've got, but um, there's only two. I've only got two. It not seem to be such a thing here. It might have been a thing um, in the old days, but, like, I don't think many people use it now. I haven't... I don't ever see it very much around here. The wallpaper. That's what I'm talking about, wallpaper. Okay, I really like this, how this is turning out. It's fairly quick. Okay. Obviously, this, this will have to be part of something when I cut it out. And I could have some of this paper. We'll rip a large expanse of it. Maybe I don't want that much. Maybe I just want a little bit down there, I think. So I'll rip that off. And we'll just, I haven't put any book page, have I? I do have some music paper, but I'll have to get up and get it. Oh, I think I'll put, oh no, I don't want to go there. I want to go here. And then here, I'll just trim that off. It's a bit sticky. And there's not enough overhanging that I can just fold it over. So I'll trim it off. That's that, and something here. Maybe little, another little piece of this, just to use it up. It's good when you use things up, then you can go and print more. Put that there. Let me see if I've got any music paper near. Here we go. Lovely old cover, this one. Um. 
we're in such a dilemma. We don't know what to have for dinner. It's a huge dilemma. I said, I said to Steffi, it's the dinner dilemma. We're having a dinner dilemma. We don't know what to have. How about that? Does anybody else have dinner dilemmas? Because that's what we're having. Got to figure it out. But, you know, we've exhausted all of the things that, that we feel like eating. And I made ragu yesterday. I, Steffi went up to San Marino to get his birthday present because his birthday's at the beginning of December. And he, um, he got a bee in his bonnet. He had to get it now. And I'm like, okay, off you go. And um, and so there's a really good butcher up there that has very good sort of organic, very good meat. And so he got some meat. So we, I said, can you get some extra because I want to make a ragu and like I'll make a big ragu and then I'll freeze it because you cook it really slowly for like five hours. Um, well, I'll have to tell you that recipe one day. Um, so so we did that so we had that for lunch so we don't feel like having meat for dinner because we've had it for lunch so now we've got a bit of a problem because we don't know what to have i like this now because i've decided they're going to be tags and or journaling cards i can actually do the back i can do the back because um i know that it's going to be for writing we can have some of this because this is quite pale and if you had a black pen or a brown pen, like, you know, you could easily write over this. So I'm going to stick this on. I'm not going to worry about those white edges because I'll be covering it. And maybe I'll take this off. The Dinner Dilemma. I really would like to be one of those people that um, does the meal prep. I'd love to be. I watch um, occasionally, actually she hasn't done a video for a long time, I don't think, Downshift, Downshift Zoology, I don't know what she's called. And she does, um, she does lots of um, cooking sort of videos. And, um, and, uh, and she does a lot of meal prep. But I think what I need to do is watch her channel and take notes and then do the shopping, get the containers, because it's probably better to store them in glass containers with lids, and then have a go at it and do it one Sunday. Just maybe plan a week. But I'm one of those people, I change my mind, and I don't feel like... But maybe if I've got everything prepared, I might... If I've got everything prepared, I might... You know, it won't, won't be such a deterrent to eat that thing that night. Am I making any sense whatsoever? Probably not probably not making any sense at all so I'm going to put this here like this I don't know if you can hear the electric car guitar going it's actually quite it's actually quite quiet he was much louder before I told him he was making a hell of a noise um, excuse the expression but he was and um, um, because you can try try to guess what his uh, present was to himself for his 50th birthday. I mean, it is an important birthday, so he got to have a nice present. But you can have a guess what it was. It's not hard. And he works hard, so I said, go for it. He said, do you want to come? And I said, no, I might hyperventilate. But yes, just go and get what you want. <laughs> Do you get it while you can? Do I want to put this? So I'm, I'm using some similar papers to what I had on the other side because these papers can be written on. This is the writing side. I'll just take that off. It's very sticky. I seem to make everything very sticky lately. Everything gets so sticky. Okay, that's that. Now let's head over here. And I do, I've got some more. Um, oh, this side. Oh, do I want to use that side? I could use that side. I can print it out again, for heaven's sake. Why do we have to be precious about printed papers? I don't know. Call me precious. 
Oh dear, you'd think it had a glass of wine and I haven't. I do like this side. I like that bit there. I'm going to rip it. Just going to rip it. Take, take the head off. Put that over there. Um, I might rip that. And that one. So you'll get a nice surprise today because there'll be a video. Yesterday I didn't put one up. I did actually upload a video. It's similar. I'll put that one. The other one I, that I, I, upload, I uploaded but didn't post, it's really similar to something I've already done. And it was really just a bonus. I just literally just turned on the camera while I was doing that. So maybe... Um, Maybe I'll post that as a bonus as well. So there'll be two. Oh, I like that. We're coming, becoming a little bit itty bitty here, but I do like that. So I've sort of re, re, re put together the one paper or I could have it like this. No, stick with the plan, Rachel. I, I've got to stay on track because I, got, I do go off track a bit, don't I? Switch to something else. Okay, so my sister posted a video today. I bet you guys saw that. She received her wonderful collaboration projects from the other other ladies. Um, so that was exciting to um, see her. I knew that I knew that there was going to be a video. Well, I didn't know there was going to be one, but um, I actually spoke to Sass today, and um, she told me she had posted her video. So I was very pleased about that that she had done that because that was exciting and oh my gosh Sarah, I don't think you'll watch this video because you haven't been watching YouTube much but that that project that I knew about that project that Sass is doing um you know for about women and um domestic violence and boy Sarah was that project amazing it's just turning out she showed it to me when she was planning it um it's just incredible and what a wonderful thing I must say so if you don't know who I'm talking about I'm talking about my sister Sarah and she's Roxy Creations by Sarah, so I'll link her channel below. Um, she has gone AWOL for a little, four months. She hadn't, she hadn't posted a video for four months. Um, but she's very busy at, at work, so um, she does she does fall off the wagon, I call it, and not do videos for a while. But then she comes back and does, you know, she'll do one. She's done one, so that's good. I'm very pleased about that. I'm just rambling on while I stick bits of paper down. Does anybody else do that? Does anybody else ramble on and stick bits of paper down? Because I do. Here we go. We've got some plain paper here. We'll put that right there. I'm just going to take off the straight edges so, so we're in theme. Although I've got crooked edges over there anyway. I've got straight edges, I want to say, over there. Oh, I don't know whether I'm Arthur or Martha. I better take that. It's very, it's very sticky. Sticky, sticky. Sticky. Oh, a nice writing on that. It's not that old, but it's just that it does have nice writing. It's running writing kind of cursive writing. There we go. We've done it. We've done both sides. In the true Jessica wrap of two silver oranges fashion, this is how this is where I learned to do this, as you guys know, but some new people might not know. Jessica wrap from two silver oranges. Mm. Now, I'm going to get my big chopper just a sec. Big one, here it comes, because this piece of paper is bigger than my other chopper. Okay, so I'm standing up and I'm just going to straighten it a little bit. bit sticky did you hear that and I'm going to chop that and then you have to look at it and decide how do you want to cut it so I'm going to have some I'd have two I might cut the bottom off There, I'm going to have something there. That's it. So from one page, that was fairly quick to do, you get quite a lot of things. To play with. So this is the, 
the back for writing and this is the front for decorating. And we've got all of these big things here that we can play with. So let's have a look. So this one is just lovely. It just needs something else and then it's done. So I'm just going to make it tag shape this one. Flip that over. And I just need to find something to go there. So we'll put that one aside and I want to look at this one. This one I think... I've been working in all areas of my room today. I'm going to round this. It's going to be a big um, journal card. Journal card, almost tag. Oh, it's a bit wet. That's you know that we know the corner chomper doesn't like it when it's wet. Okay, so let's find something to put on there, and we'll put all of the noise over here. I'm calling it noise because it's in my way. This might look nice. I think I've taken my little scissors to the other table just there. I'll have, to, and there's a bit of a mess on there now because I moved everything off this table over there so I could do get Christmas out again okay isn't that lovely I think this might be um what's her name what's her name her name is her name is um um, 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 um oh gosh I'm having a blank again where are my big bits this one dreams etc that's it got it dreams etc that's who it is so let me see what do i have in here that might look lovely on there see that might be good on something oh isn't she lovely i like her she might be good on something these are going to be too big that might be okay but we'll see we shall see oh i love that santa Angel can be good. Oh, Mrs. Cog. I forgot about Mrs. Cog. Where are my other Mrs. Cogs? I had them all pulled out here. Um, I'm going to put a Mrs. Cog with that, I think. Yes, I am. Just a sec. I've got more. I put printed out heaps. I must use them. I must use them. I must. So let's just have a quick squeeze, a quick squeezy squid. Now that one there, I'm going to cut that out. That's just going to be made. It's going to be backed with something, and that's going to be a tag. A, uh, you know what I mean, a journal card. So that's what we'll do with that one. That's instantaneous. Oh, see, that could be cute, the colours. Let's just, we'll slip off the ones that might be the go. Wrong shape. Cute, so cute. All so cute. Oh, they're mine. So they can you can easily make those into journal cards. And then they and then they just go in in the bag. So I don't need to do that in front of you. Oh, they're mine. What happened to Mrs. Cog? Mrs. Cog, come back to me. Where are you? Here you are. Oh, look at that cat. Isn't it cute? I love the doggy too. The doggy I would... Oh, let's cut the doggy out too. Oh, there's all these wonderful words too, but they're white. I don't want them like that. I'd have to, I'd have to give them a squirt with some coffee. I think I like the cat. I think I'm, I'm leaning to... Oh, look at these. They're so cute. So cute. Oh, if I forget to link the, the these in the description box, I linked them, I think, in the previous Christmas video that I did. I had linked Mrs. Cog, her shop, and I just bought a selection of her Christmas digis. And she was having a sale. I haven't seen... She could still be having the sale now, um, but I'm not sure how long it was going for. So cute. It really is cute. Now, let's not get distracted by the cuteness. Okay, so we could have this one super cute the cat might be too big i'd have to trim it down so let's do the doggy
and then I'm going to jump up and grab, if you don't mind, if you don't mind at all, I'm going to jump up and grab my box with the things that I hand stitch because I don't think I've used them all. And some of those might look nice on these because we don't have to worry about bulkiness. So someone asked me, what would you do with the bag? And she wasn't, she really liked it, but she wasn't quite sure what do you do with it? Well, you could, you, like it's got the little journal in there. So you could, um, you could use it for your December daily, really. I reckon there's probably enough pages in the book. If you made the book, you could make sure there were enough pages in the book to do your December daily. Um, but also, even if there weren't, isn't that wonderful? I love this. That worked really well. Let me just grab my um, box. I'll turn the light on too, just a sec. Oh, yes, that's better. I'll let there be light. I bought this box at the antique market. I just love it. And I put some of those Christmas things in there. See, I have these. We can use these. I've got lots of them. I haven't used them all. Because I did use a few here and there in the Christmas journals that I made. But I didn't use them all. Because I didn't want to bulk it up too much. So this one, for example, has the... Oh, isn't that cute? But I don't want to cover the writing. I don't know. No, I won't put that on there. What about this one? Yeah, that one will do. Now, I wonder which glue do I use of these new glues. I think I'll try this one. And I probably won't even stitch around this. It doesn't have to be stitched. Put that there. Oh, I think that's yummy. There we go. So I'll put that aside. Next. Isn't this fun? I, I'm, well, I'm having fun. I don't know about you guys. So this can be a tall tag. I might leave it that shape. We'll leave it that shape. How about that? And let's see. Oh, I, I thought I'd lost my lid. I'll put that on there. Put that back over there. Now let's see what long things do we have. Tall, long things. See, I don't want to chop her arm off. I don't think that's very nice. So I won't chop your arm off, dear. That's words. Santa won't fit. I might just cut Santa out just in case. I know it won't fit, but I might, if I don't have to chop off, if I, if I, now what do I want to say? Who knows what I want to say? I want to say that if I'm not chopping off something essential, then I don't mind if Santa doesn't fit and I'll chop it off. You know, like if I'm not chopping off a Santa arm or feet or head, I could chop off a bit of his dress or his Santa sack. It just depends how much. So that's why I'm cutting it out. So we'll see how much I might need to chop off. He's a beautiful Santa. He really is a beautiful Santa. Just beautiful. It kind of blends in on that one. Well, we've got other ones. Now that's really narrow. I think I'll cut that one into two. Here we go. We've got this one. This one's very tall too. Needs to be chopped down a bit. So, no. Santa covers up too much, I think. So we won't use Santa. He's not, he needs to be a bit narrower. So we'll have a look at this girl. I'm using the big scissors, guys. Just don't be afraid. It'll be all right. My face is not near. And also, if you notice, I don't, I'm not really moving the scissors too much. I'm actually jiggling the piece of paper. So, except for when I go to pull the piece off the scissors, yes, they do fly around a bit. I fling them. Lucky I've got glasses on, because if I got myself in the eye, it would pretty much get my glasses, I think. Okay, let's see what's going to happen here. If we're going to like this. I don't mind that. Don't mind that at all. Oh, I think I like it better on there. But that's so tall, that one. I need to trim it off. Or do I prefer it up there where you get a bit of all of it up there? So I'll just get my trimmer. Oh, oh it's got stuff on it. 
grab my trimmer and I'm just going to trim a bit off this one because it is too long. You could cut it up into two tags, two smaller tags, but I'm going to have bigger tags here. Um, I'll probably just put that aside. Who knows if I might ever need it. I might, I might not. And I'm going to glue the lovely girl there. Maybe not on that piece. Flip it over. Okay, so that's that. And then, do I have space? Not really. I could put squeeze that on there. 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 Could I squeeze it up there? Not really. Um, not even a whale tail. I don't think it, they're all too big, those. Can't even pick it up, can I? I love that. This one. No, because then that'll be annoying when I slip it into the pocket. So this one, I think I'm just going to leave it as it is. Right around the corners. I think I'd... Oh, no, here, I'm going to snip the corners. They're going to be snipped. I've been liking snipped corners lately. So we'll snip those. And that would be just a tag popping in the pocket. Now, we've got this one. And that one needs to be chop, chopped down. And we've got this one here. So we can finish off this one. So on this one, we could... I don't want that. Not the right colour. I think I could put something like that up there. I really like that. So let's get the glue and glue that down. And if I could find some good words, I could put words there. What are you up to, BB? I'm Oh, okay. We've got still got the dinner dilemma. Got any suggestions? Why don't you cook dinner? <laughs> that would be funny. Well, we don't want meat. We had meat for lunch. Right? Ragu! It had all kinds of yummy meat in it. Oh, yeah, I really like that. guys didn't hear what she said to me <laughs> do you want a vegan sweep <laughs> what did you say vegan soup. oh a vegan soup <laughs> I thought you said a vegan sweep I thought that's a funny thing to say <laughs> I don't know I thought you meant like maybe you were meaning like a vegan banquet I know I'm covering up that paper but I felt like this needed something behind no that's too busy I don't like that so I think I'm just going to glue that there. Yes. A vegan sweep. Nope, a vegan soup. Why did you say vegan? It could have been very vegetarian. Oh, just what popped into your mind. Okay, and then we've got this one. What would we like on there? Let's put the box on the ground. We have enough on our table without having that there. Um, where did the Mrs. Cogs go? There's plenty of narrow ones. That's cute. Oh my 
goodness i love that i love the christmas animals they're so cute that would be pretty and this one because i could trim it down a bit oh that's going to be so pretty i think it's going to be that one let's get the get the this that's very good english isn't it the this let's get the this and cut cut it down i need to trim a bit more than that actually Okay, and while I'm at it, oopsie, I'm going to cut this one in half. Is That's what's going to happen there, about half. So it's really a large expanse of one colour, but that's all right. We can survive with, the, cope with that, I should say. We can cope. So for the moment, we're looking at this one, and I think I like that up there. I am covering up a bit the writing, but it doesn't matter. So I'm going to put that up there. Oh, I don't want to go too high though, do I? If I want to bring um, the writing back in action, I can always um, I can always put you know collage over it and put some more writing there. It's not the end of the world. So that's there. I didn't want to put it up too high because I want to put one of these, but I don't want to cover all of the beautiful paper. I like that one, so I'll glue that in there, and then we'll we'll do something. Here, we need something there. So I haven't used this glue much. I have used um, the glitter glue. It's fantastic. Um, yep, I like the glitter, glitter glue. And I haven't I hadn't used this one much yet, but it seems to be very good. See, it's already holding. No smell whatsoever. No smell. So that's also a bonus. Okay, I think I'm start. I need to drink some water. I I'm starting to get a bit of a, um, you know, when you get that sort of dry sore throat. That's what I'm getting. I don't. Ha I'm not sick. Don't worry. I'm not sick. I'm just. I think I'm a bit dehydrated because we went. Steph and I went for a walk before. We couldn't get Missy Moo to come with us. She doesn't come for walks. Do you, Lulu? She's not listening. It's probably for the best. Hmm. Have a double whammy in there. No, no good writing there. I'm not going to do a double whammy. Um. Oh, just a secy. We've got postage stamps. Too much. Too much. Too much. And oh, we've got some more over here of things. Well, that could be good. Now, let me just come back to this one that I couldn't find a solution for. This one. Although that, no, that's going to cover. Well, I quite like that. Even though it covers her hat a bit. Or could I put it on the side? Something different? No. I prefer it on the top. I'm going to glue it there. What I'm going to do is... Um, just not put it down as low as I normally would. I'll show you what I mean. I'm just going to put it there. Like normally I would slide it down a bit further. Like that. Well, I did slide it down a little bit. Normally I'd have that bit sort of level with there. But I don't want to cover her hat too much. But that's better. That's working better for me now. Okay. And this, oh, like this one. Oh, here's a bit of this. We could have a bit of that. I've not been able to find a home for that one. Nope. Too big. None of that's working. I don't think I've got any smaller things on the... Oh, I've got, I've got the round... The, oh, just a minute. Hold your horses. There's something here. What's here? Ho, ho, ho. 25. Let's have a look at the 25. These are always um, dreams, etc. These ones. Oops. Oh, it's so I just carefully trim around that if I can.
So I've still got to, um, actually I thought I might like a bit of that. I've still got to, um, um, I've still got to, um, what do I want to say? Finish off the journal. Does anybody want to see that? Because we've already seen that before. Um, so you may not want to see that again. And then I can put kind of finish it off. It's all finished. So I thought I might use a bit of this. Just going to grab a piece because it's very um, sticky stuff. This stuff, and it um, it does. You do get a funny feeling on your fingers because there's because of the glue. So I thought I might put that on there like that, and then because I can't see where my Giotto glue is, I'll go like this and press that down on there. There we go. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Now, next. What? Oh, I thought I had two more. I do. Here they are. Here they are. I've got these two cute little ones. So... Well, first of all, I might put a little bit of music paper on there because we've lost a bit of our collage. It's not very good tearing. Not very good tearing. Why right now? This paper's just tearing in a very crooked way. Put that up there. I think I'll put it up there. Put that. I'm just going to glue it on there and see what happens. And we could have a little piece of this. Okay, now, what little things do we have? I'd have to chop her off a bit or forget about her. They're not going to fit. There was some more. I love this Santa. I should get my chopper, but I'm just going to do it by hand. I'm just going to trim off a bit more. straight mm. covers it all up don't know who is who your dad's talking to Lulu it there that's going to go there cute so that one's small enough to fit on there because so I think I used a lot of my um, ones that I had from my fussy cutting kit too um, when, we, when I was making the journals and things because I haven't printed it out again so that's that that's so cute that's a little bit big that one don't want blue that's a bit blendy cute. Two 
pretty big. They're all huge. None of those, none of the above. Okay, well. We need something there. I might. Where's my other Christmas paper here? I want red. Not, this is not particularly Christmas paper, but I, it's red, so I put it in there. I'm going to do a tab like this. That one's done, and now we've got to find something to go on this one. Now, do I have anything small here? I don't think so. I've got rubbish in here. Um, <laughs> I don't think I've got anything small left. I think I've used it all. That's small-ish. There she is. Oh, there's a towel. Oh, it's got stuff on it. So that's the wrong colour. That's not Christmas. That could go there, but it blends in a bit. And I don't like her. I don't like her on there. The colours aren't right. Maybe I could have something like this. I know they're meant to be double for something, but I um, I just cut them in half and then I get two for the price of one. Yeah, I think I'll put that there and have some writing down there. Possibly not too high. There we go. And some writing. Well, what about this this came off the um, minte paper I'm gonna cut this I'm gonna, I can stick it across like that or I could cut the words and then put one up and one down maybe I prefer that So one there, and one like this, there we go, that's done, and then can we fit something there, something fancy? big I made them too big those ones are all too big they're meant to they're for pages they're no good for tags don't mind that one all right grab this glue 
These were the hand stitched ones, so I can't cut them down because then the hand stitching will come undone. Cute. And then I might just do this one. I think that's it. So I've got this one here. I think I'll just put her there. Love those. I've got more of those. I need to scan them. Late 1800s they are. Like that. And then we can put maybe this one. Yeah. I'll put that one. I think I'll put it that way. No, wait. I don't like it that way. The other way. Okay. And then we'll see what they look like in the bag. Okay, so where's my bag? Here it is. I didn't make anything to go in there. I need to do that, but we can do that in another. We'll finish it off in the next video. So then I've got all of these tags from that one. They've got a bit of rubbish on them. From that one piece of paper. See how cute is that? And they just slide in your little pocket there. You can put a few in the back. You end up with this bag full of fun, thi fun things. So what I was saying was you've got your little journal in the back. We can go on the front. You see how pretty is this? Um, you have your little journal in the back. And um, and so it could do your Christmas. You can put that in there. Christmas daily. Um, oh, it's perfect. Just have it just like that. And that goes in there. And that can go behind there. Um, and then if there weren't enough pages, then you can have days on your tags as well. I think that's so much fun. And what a beautiful, what a fun gift to give someone. So let me know if you want me to um, finish decorating the journal. Um, and then I'll tie a bow around it. Um, otherwise, I'll just come back and show you it all complete. How about that? So you just let me know what you would like me to do. So I hope everyone's having a great day um, and I will see you again tomorrow. Have a great evening. Bye.